Are you embarrassed by the corns on your feet? Watch this video to learn how to get rid of them for good. You'll be able to enjoy wearing sandals and going barefoot without worrying about those pesky corns. Corns are those painful bumps on the bottom of your feet. They are caused by friction between your foot and the ground. Corns that remain for a long time may become infected, making them swell and causing pain. Corns, sometimes, result from shoes that don't fit your feet properly. Too tight shoes can cause corns because the foot has difficulty moving within them. You might be able to see corns on your feet if you wear shoes or boots that don't fit well. When you walk, your foot moves across the floor, rubbing against it. This friction can cause corns on the bottom of your feet. Your feet may rub against the edge of the shoe or boot and cause corns or blisters on your heel. Corns also may be caused by hard floors or stairs. If you have corns on your feet, you might want to try wearing socks that fit better. Here are the best natural remedies to eliminate corns on the feet. 1. Soak your feet with Epsom salt. Epsom salt is a natural mineral salt. It has many uses in the home and helps relieve pain and swelling. This salt is good for your skin and hair as well. The minerals in Epsom salt have a soothing effect on your feet, making them feel better. Epsom salt draws the fluid out of your feet and cures the corns. As mentioned above, the mineral salts benefit your skin as they return your feet to normal. You can soak your feet with this natural remedy daily until you no longer have any symptoms of corns on your feet. 2. Moisturize your feet with cocoa butter. Cocoa butter is a natural moisturizer for your skin and can also treat corns. This butter is made from shea butter, extracted from the cocoa tree's nut. It has been found that cocoa butter draws fluid out of your feet due to its natural healing properties. It is also antifungal and antibacterial, and it helps to prevent itching. Apply several thin layers of cocoa butter on your feet every night before going to bed, and you may see improvement in your corns. You can also make a foot cream with cocoa butter and store it in the refrigerator to use any time. 3. Rub your feet with a pumice stone. Rubbing pumice stone is another treatment that can help with corns and calluses. This act is because the pumice stone has sharp edges that will scrape the dead skin off your feet. The pumice stone must be used in a circular motion to ensure you remove all the dead skin on your feet. A little pumice stone can be used regularly to remove dead skin on your feet, making them look and feel soft. You can also use it as a foot scrubber to exfoliate your feet regularly. 4. Make a foot powder. You can use a foot powder instead of those who do not have time to apply the pumice stone regularly. It is because foot powders are already made to exfoliate feet and are very easy to apply. You can also use a foot scrubber to apply the powder. Foot powders are available in any retail store. 5. Apply corn pads or foot mittens. Corn pads and foot mittens are made to protect your feet from heat and moisture. You need to apply corn pads first to heal corns on your foot. These pads are made from a special material that can absorb the moisture from your feet. This way, you do not have to walk barefoot and you can protect your feet from the hot weather. To prevent corns on your foot, you must apply corn pads before going outside. They will help to keep your feet dry and are easy to use. You can choose the size that you need by measuring your foot. Your corn pad should be around one inch smaller than your foot size. For example, if you have a size nine feet, your corn pad should be eight inches in diameter. Then, you can use the corn pad to cover your feet. Six, use eucalyptus oil. Eucalyptus oil is a natural antiseptic and antifungal agent that can treat corns naturally. It is commonly used in aromatherapy to treat colds and flu as it has a strong smell known to help you sleep at night. This oil also helps to heal wounds, abrasions, and cuts. You can mix it with other essential oils for a more substantial effect. Apply this oil on your feet regularly to get rid of the corns. 7. Apply castor oil. Castor oil is a natural remedy to treat corns. It has antibacterial and anti-inflammatory properties that help heal the corn's skin. This oil can be used in many ways to treat the feet corns. You can apply castor oil directly to the skin. 
You can also mix it with a few drops of your favorite essential oils for a natural remedy for corns on the feet. It is advised to dilute the essential oil with castor oil before applying it to your feet. 8. Rub tea tree oil on the affected area. Tea tree oil is another natural remedy to treat corns on the feet. This oil has antiseptic and antimicrobial properties that help heal the affected area on your feet. You can apply tea tree oil to the skin and leave it overnight. In the morning, you should wash your feet with warm water. You can also mix two drops of tea tree oil with a few drops of castor oil and apply it directly to the corns. 9. Use almond oil. Almond oil is one of the best remedies to treat corns on the feet. This oil has antimicrobial properties that can help treat this ailment. It can help fight infection, reduce pain, and speed up healing. To use this remedy, you should remove all traces of dead skin on your feet and clean them with warm water. Soak your feet in a bowl of warm water and add some drops of almond oil to it. Keep your feet in this mixture for 30 minutes, then rinse them with cold water. Also, you can apply almond oil directly to the affected area and leave it overnight. 10. Soak your feet in oatmeal. Oatmeal has been used as a natural remedy for corns since the time of ancient Greece. It is a rich source of beta-glucan which. Beta-glucan is not only found in oats but also in many other plants. Several studies support oatmeals used to treat corns and calluses on the feet. Oatmeal is also a good source of zinc, which helps to make new skin cells. You can use oatmeal as a foot bath to combat corns and calluses. The best way to use oatmeal is to soak your feet in it for 15 minutes daily. Also, you can soak two cups of oatmeal in two quarts of warm water. Apply and leave them on your feet overnight, and remove any crust formed overnight. As you can see there are several ways to get rid of corns on the feet. One of the most effective methods is to use a pumice stone to file down the corn. Another option is to soak the feet in warm water and Epsom salt for 15 minutes. The solution will help soften the corn and make it easier to remove. Finally, if the corn is causing pain or discomfort, a doctor can prescribe a medication or cream to help get rid of it. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on how to treat corns, calluses and cracked heels with aspirin and lemon juice. Thanks for watching and bye for now.